Uh, we've been really limited in our practice abilities. The, um, many of our matches have been canceled. Our first scheduled match is next Monday, and unfortunately that's mid-conference, so we'll be starting out our season uh, normally where the middle of our season is supposed to be. Well, when you're not out on the course, you're not getting the reps in the field that you need um, of what the course can give you, so a lot of our practices are indoors, and um, we're just chipping and putting on artificial turf, so there's a lot of feel that we're not getting that um, but none of the teams are getting, so we'll just have to come together when, when we can finally get out on the golf course. We have just been practicing inside a lot, and the prices aren't as good. And it's really hard to do like longer sprints because we can because like the hallways aren't that big. But it's been interesting. I do jumps most of the time, so it's that hasn't been too difficult because you just have to do like run throughs, and that's like 89 feet or whatever. Um, so I haven't been as drastically affected, but some of like the major sprinters have had like shin splints and like tight hamstrings from like running through the hallways and like on the cement floor rather than the track. Uh, well, we had to cancel a game already, but we did get one game in, and it was in the rain, which was like freezing rain. Um, well, all our practices have either been moved indoors or rescheduled, and uh, we've had a couple of games rescheduled so far, so it's been sort of a bummer trying to get all the new kids to uh, learn while we can't really get playing time on the fields. Sometimes they have to get canceled because Ultimate doesn't have as much like time as other sports. We have trouble scheduling, so sometimes we have, like, normally we'd be indoors, but there's other sports that have to get inside as well, so. When we don't have any room for the fields or inside the gym, we really just have to kind of work on throwing by ourselves at home and stuff, so it's kind of a bummer. Usually it's wind and rain are the biggest factors, because being that it's a frisbee and it's meant to fly, the wind can always push it off course and you have to throw it differently in the wind. You say and you don't care? The rain always makes it harder to throw and catch as well because the, the plastic disc can get really slippery. So We haven't been affected that much actually because the turf kind of gets cleared off. So We've had most of our practices, but uh, we had one day where we were unable to practice outside. We had to do film and a little bit of stick work indoors.